What is up guys? Welcome back to the Pokemon Station. In today's video, we're going to be opening up another mystery power box. You can get this particular box at Walmart for $29. It comes with five booster packs and a 1 in 10 chance of having a vintage pack. So without further ado, let's see if we can get a vintage pack in today's video. Let's go. Alright everyone, welcome back to the channel. Here is the mystery power box that we're going to be opening today. So yes, as I said, five booster packs and you have a chance of getting a vintage pack. The odds of getting one are probably slim to none, but nonetheless, I have two of these. I'm gonna open up this one in today's video and then we'll open up the other one in another video. So here is the front randomly inserted pack. Here's uh, maybe one of the ones you can pull. And then we have the back here. It tells you kind of basically what, what's going on in this box, but yeah. So here is the box. I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing open. We're gonna open up one pack at a time. Hopefully we can get that randomly inserted vintage pack. That's always the goal. Also for $29, you know, you're, you're paying a lot kind of for five packs. So hopefully we can get the vintage pack. Alrighty, let's do this one pack at a time. Let's see what we can do. So our very first pack, we have a fusion strike. So I might move this over here a little bit. I'll move it right here. Okay. Perfect. All right, so here's the very first booster pack, Fusion Strike. Hopefully, we can get something decent. We shall see. The set is not the best, so worst case, you know, we're not going to get anything crazy. Maybe just like a hollow. And one, two, three. I believe this one's still four to the front. We are going to find out. Yes, it is. So we have a Psychic Type Energy Trainer Supporter. Okay, Sligu, Stuffle, not bad, not anything crazy yet. Totodile, that's pretty cool. Bun oh, I almost said Bunnelby, but uh, Baneri. Okay, and then we have a regular rare for our very first pack. So no first pack magic, but we're going to continue with our second booster pack. Let's see what we can get. And it is a, okay, Darkness Ablaze, not bad. We can get a Charizard from this particular set. So hopefully we can pull that. That would be awesome. Let's see if we can do it. I haven't actually opened up one of these packs in a while, so this is going to be pretty interesting, to say the least. Two, three, four to the front, and let's see what we can get. We have an Electric-type Energy Trainer Fossil, Fletchender, uh, Zoellis, okay, or Zoellis, Aeron, Torchic, Reverse, and then a Flygon Regular Rare. I think that was a green card too, so I'm pretty sure with this set in particular, if it's a green card, you're not going to get anything. But let's go to our third pack. We have, okay, Lost Origins, not bad. We can get the Giratina or possibly the Aerodactyl. Let's see if we can get the Aerodactyl, that'd be sweet. Or the Giratina, honestly, I think I want the Giratina a lot more. All right, so there is another code card. Let me know what you get in the comments if you redeem it. And let's see what we can do. All right, so we have a Psychic Type Energy, Seedra, oh, almost skipped one, just a Supporter, Porygon, Ducklet, Blipbug, Finian, ooh, Politoed Reverse, and we have another Rare. I hope these aren't Wade. That would suck. All right, let's see what else we can get. And our other pack is a Chilling Rain. So very, I think Chilling Rains is kind of up there with Steam Siege. It's, uh, you know, it's not a really good set. I think I remember going to a store, I think last, I think last Black Friday, and literally they were just giving them out. So they're not the best set to get, but nonetheless, hopefully we can get something decent because as of right now, we have pulled nothing. So we have a water type energy, Raboot, trainer supporter, Ladyba, Porygon, Swirlix, Sneasel. We have a Snover. Supporter Trainer Reverse, and then, okay, we have a Hollow. So, a Porygon Z Hollow, but, you know, it's better than just a regular rare. Also, we are going to be displaying, I probably should have said this in the beginning, but we are going to be displaying the Fossil Golbat, one of my brother's favorite Pokemon, so uh, shout out to him. Let's see what else we can get. I think we have, uh, that's our last pack, and it's another Lost Origins, so... No vintage pack in today's video. Pulls are at a minimum with one hollow, but uh, hopefully we can get something good out of this last pack and make this video somewhat decent. But yeah, that's the risky run with the mystery power boxes. You know, you, you have a chance, but with MJ holding, I don't even know. They're, they're packs. I mean, you get packs with it, but 
The odds of getting a vintage pack are slim to none. But yes, we have a fire type energy, an awesome haunter, polywirl, uh, licky licky, uh, ducklet, rock rough, seal, uh, let's see, snover, a reverse, and then a pyroar hollow. So uh, yeah, we didn't pull that good of cards in today's video. We had two hollows, you know, that's kind of the risk you run with opening booster packs in general. But yeah, I want to say thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Stay tuned. We're going to be opening up another one of these boxes here very soon. Also, I have some ETBs we're going to be opening on the channel as well from the 151 set. So definitely smash the subscribe button so you don't miss out on that. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll catch you all next Saturday for another video. Take care.